Oh, your eyewitness weather forecast. Well, good morning. We are starting off with plenty of sunshine today, but the cloud cover is going to make a comeback later on, and then we'll have to watch out for some rain showers making their way in later this afternoon and going through this evening. But it's a beautiful end to the morning here in Treverton. The temperature right around 50. There's a lot of sunshine getting through. It does feel a little bit more like 46 once we factor in that wind every now and then, which is starting to pick up from this morning. Temperatures are actually mainly in the 50s for the most part, with the exception of the northern tier and some of those higher elevations like Mount Pocono. We're at 46, Pottsville 51, Sealands Grove 54, and Wilkesbury and Scranton at 51. Satellite and radar will take it out for a wider view, still locking into some sunshine at this point, but the clouds are on the increase and there's those rain showers that are dragging along with it. So eventually that rain that's up in the Great Lakes will pivot down to the south and east and that's where our showers are going to come from a little bit later on. So you don't need the umbrella right now, but it will be necessary later in the day as some of that rain moves through. Temperatures will make it into the mid and the upper 50s today. It's pretty close to average for this time of year. The average is right around 59. Then going through this evening, we drop back down into the 40s. The wind has slowly been picking up. It's nowhere near as gusty as it was this time yesterday, but it still does pick up every now and then. A good 10 to even 20 miles per hour, but look what happens through this evening. We get a big drop off in that wind speed as it really starts to slack off tonight and going into tomorrow. But it's this area of low pressure and this warm front that will bring us those showers as we go later into the day today. So just going through the second half of the afternoon and this evening, a good idea to have the umbrella ready. An area of high pressure tries to build into our north and east for tomorrow. Notice that that tries to thin out the cloud cover, though we're not that far off from being stuck in the clouds. So it's going to be a battle to get some sunshine as we go through the day tomorrow. A second warm front will lift north tomorrow night and into early Thursday. That's going to give us just a few more showers by Thursday morning. Once we get to Thursday afternoon, all of that is pretty much out of here. Look at the warmer air that's moving back in on Thursday. So we'll get a good bump in that temperature, but then we track out another storm system coming on a Friday. So late Friday into Friday night, we're expecting scattered showers and even a couple of thunderstorms to come rumbling back through. So you'll want to check back for updates on that. 58 for the high today. It's not as windy. Sunshine continuing this morning, but then the cloud cover comes back along with a few showers later on. The wind is at 10 to 20 miles per hour. 38 for the overnight low tonight, and it's just not quite as cold. There's a few more showers to go around. The sun setting at 744. 62 tomorrow and battling the cloud cover. Thursday also at 62. Scattered showers and storms late Friday that will spill over to Saturday. Sunday we are near 60 with just a few more showers, then we'll dry out by Monday. And you can always download the Eyewitness Weather app for your latest updates on the weather. The forecast is always available for you at pahomepage.com. Temperature-wise, that seven-day is not that bad. Now it's going to get a little wet toward the end of the week and the mm -hmm. weekend, but we're still in the 70s and 60s. That's where you want to be, right? Cracking back into the 70s, especially... I mean, everything that we saw yesterday yes. morning, a little more comfortable now, yes, which very is nice. good. Thanks, Stephanie. Well, power.